Under the big top, the famous Walenda team was three stories in the air at Circus Sarasota when this nightmare unfolded. Five performers plummeting to the ground. Miraculously, they survived. Four of them, though, remain in area hospitals with critical injuries. One has been released. And one of the trauma surgeons who helped in the story of survival tells us the injured are lucky to be alive. Our Melanie Michael is live for us tonight at Circus Sarasota. And Mel, tonight we are hearing from Nick Walenda himself. We certainly are, Jen. Good evening to you. And what a story he has to tell. This was a terrifying and tragic moment, something that no one will ever forget. You know, it's my worst nightmare. You, you, I just, I'm waiting to wake up. I don't, I don't even know what to say. It's shocking. Uh, praise God that everybody is going to walk out of their own will. From uh, everything that we've heard, there is nothing that's life-threatening whatsoever. Panic under the big top. Nick Melinda spoke exclusively with NBC News, telling his story to correspondent Carrie Sanders, emphasizing both grace and gratitude after this accident. And as I've said many times, when one goes, you're, you're linked together. You know, that's my family. Those are my kids. Not literally, but they're my kids, siblings. Um, you know, people that I love, that I literally trust my life with. Check this out. Ambulance has arrived quickly at Circus Sarasota after those terrifying moments for Walinda and his troop. They were on a high wire roughly 30 feet in the air, practicing an eight-man pyramid. However, things went horribly wrong when someone stumbled and disrupted everyone's balance. Five people fell to the ground. Circus Sarasota organizers tell us this stunt had never been done at this height before. They also tell us those who were injured, despite some scary moments, are hoping to get back under the big top in just a few months. And we certainly wish them the best of luck in their recovery. And as they say in show business, Jen, the show must go on. That's exactly what will happen on Friday when it opens here at Circus Sarasota. Meanwhile, tomorrow morning at 1030, Nick Walinda will be at a press conference to talk about some of the details about what happened here today. Uh, really such a scary situation, Jen. Very scary. Do we know yet the identities of the other performers? We will most likely find that out tomorrow morning. So again, a, a big day tomorrow because I think we're going to be filled in on a lot of these details that we are waiting for. But my goodness, we are uh, really wishing the best for those folks who are in the hospital tonight recovering. Our thoughts are certainly with them. Melanie Michael live in Sarasota for us tonight. Thanks, Mel. And now to some breaking news. Two